All right, what is going on, everybody? We're here with the Pokemon Sword and Shield Crown Hunter Ranked Doubles video, and today I'm here with Specially Offensive Blaziken. Uh, I think it's really good. I don't know if it's better than physical. It's obviously, like, naturally weaker than physical, but special attackers cannot be intimidated, so it's, you know, a little bit more useful in certain scenarios, I guess. I don't know. It can be, like, instant or better, I think, maybe. I have no idea. We'll see. Anyway, this is the team, and I will be back to the first battle. Okay, that's funny. Okay. <laughs> I have Swampert and Blaziken, and we're fighting Sceptile. Uh, they're obviously policy unburdened Sceptile with Ice Shard Glaceon, right? Which is super lit, because I love Glaceon. It is my favorite Pokemon, for those who are unaware. But, I do think Blaziken has the advantage here. Depending on if they're physical or special, because they get have acrobatics. Mm, uh, I think, regardless, I don't see much of a downside to running in DD Blaziken here. I can just, like, start setting up speed, going for, uh, uh, flares and knuckles or whatever. Or maybe I want to go Alchemy and Protect, but that would allow them to get the Sceptile strategy up and to be faster than me. Uh, I think Blaziken and Didi's kind of hard from the beat. They obviously have Latios, though, which walls my entire set, which is a whack. But I can go with the Urshifu for that, I think. Um, Urshifu is very, very good here, and I don't see a reason not to bring it, so I'm going to bring it. And last, I don't really see use for the Zarina here, so I'm going to go with the Swampert. Because Swampert does damage to, like, Latios, it can deal with the Toxtricity, the uh, Cinderace as well. Alright, let's see. Oh, I almost, okay, so I almost ran uh, Sceptile in place of Zarina on this team for uh, for the, the Pledge. I don't know what it's called, like, the, the Burning Field or whatever, with Fire Pledge and Grass Pledge, but... I just don't think it's super worth it. It's kind of obvious anyway, so like they would know what you're going for. So I just don't feel it's like super safe to go for it. Sceptile Glaceon. Oh, I love that. Oh, I'm fighting a Glaceon user, bro. I love Glaceon so much. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I can just redirect here. There's no like, reason not to. Um, I don't even have to go for the uh, Protect either. I can just go for the uh, Damage, I'm pretty sure, because they can't really do much to me. So, I'm going to follow me, and I'm going to go for the Heat Wave. Straight up. <laughs> I was going to go for, like, an Aura Sphere or whatever, but there's no point, right? So, or, like, a Max Flare either. There's, there's no point in maxing right now. So, I'm going to follow me, and I'm going to go for this. But they're obviously going to get the policy on Sceptile, the Dynamax, so that might not be great for me right now. And I might not be able to take a Blizzard too well, and they might have Mirror Coat. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Wait a minute, no! Okay, if the Glaceon Mirror coast me right now, I am more than happy with it. I'm, I am okay with that. I am 100% okay with that. I'm hoping they still go for the Ice Shark for whatever reason, though. Like, that'd be ideal. It wouldn't make any sense, but it'd be ideal. The Helping Hand! Oh my god, support Glaceon, bro? That sounds lit. That sounds super lit. Okay. Uh, so the fortunate thing here is I'm slower than them, so they're not going to get a boosted attack off. It's gonna be Quake as well, okay. Um, now... Okay, uh, I was about to say, that did a lot of damage to my Ndidi, yeah? That was a crit, and it also boosts their spit out, so they live a hit even easier. Okay. Uh, but it still does all the damage to them anyway, which is lit, okay. Uh, it does activate on Burden and Policy, but now they're faster guaranteed than everything they have, so... Or than, than everything on the field right now. So, that means they are guaranteed to hit the Ndidi, because they cannot priority move me with the Glaceon, so, that's lit. Uh... Hmm... I'm gonna max Flare Sceptile, because even if they, uh, max guard this turn, if I max guard next turn, I get the extra speed boost, so, it's worthwhile. I'm going to follow me as well. Or oh, I could hit the Glacia. No, that's no point. Okay. There's no point. Uh, this follow me should get the Sceptile killed, but they could also max guard. But like I said, even if they do, I have speed boost, so I'm pretty sure. I'm actually gonna calc it right now. Hold on. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna damage calc right now. Uh let's see. Sceptile, level 50, 252, timid nature, unburden is activated, versus a Blaziken, level 50. They did max guard, that's fine. Modest nature at plus three speed. I would not outspeed them. Okay. Um, no, that's crazy. Oh, because they're base 120 to be fair, but still. Okay, uh, that's fine. 
So they can now quake blades, which they're going to do. But I could just go into like I don't know. <laughs> or maybe oh what did I go into here? I can go into Urshifu. I can go into Urshifu. I think they would quake Blaziken. I feel like they would. Right? God, how am I losing with the Sceptile Glaziken combo with the Blaziken right now? Uh, if I just max Flare turn 1, it was over. Uh, okay. Um. I don't necessarily need Urshifu. I hope the max guard is not too obvious here, so I'm gonna go for it. And I'm gonna go for the Wicked Blow into the. I could just kill the Glaceon right now, but the Sceptile is way too big of a threat. I have to get rid of it. Hmm. But I could just do that next turn. No, I'm gonna hit it this turn. I'm not that scared of Glaceon right now. I'm not. I'm, I'm not really scared at all, honestly. They helping hand. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Um, I think they're gonna. No, they helping handed. They wouldn't quake. Blazing. There's no point. You're plus. Okay. All right. You are plus two anyway, buddy. But all right. We can blow. And we knocked them out. Let's go. Okay. Uh, I don't know why they helping handed there. There was no point. They were plus two. Uh, they were plus two. They would have O-Code. 100% they would have. But it works out for me, so that works. Okay. So now we have a plus three speed Blaziken on the field right now. Uh, Latios. So... I don't see why I can't just knuckle Glaceon and go for the Wicked Blow into Latios. I don't know what they could do to me. So I'm just going to go for that. They could Draco, obviously, but it wouldn't KO, I don't think. Urshifu is very bulky, but Latios is very strong. Hmm. And they also have that move, which I forgot about. Okay, well, in hindsight, maybe it would have been worthwhile to switch out in the Swamper just now. Because now I might lose. Actually, the Draco Meteor... Oh, but they're in the terrain. They can just go for psychic move. They're probably just gonna kill Blaziken, actually. That'd be a throw. Hardcore. If they kill Blaziken right now, it's such a throw, bro. That's such a throw. That's such a throw! Why would you do that? Okay. <laughs> Alright. Why would you do that? Oh my god. I have never seen someone so hardcore target a blaziken in my entire life goodbye there's an urshifu dark on the screen why didn't you hit it whatsoever okay goodbye buddy goodbye i don't know what they were doing just now i really don't like they they used max quake twice first of all one of them did 90 percent of my indeedy without even being boosted yet but like well it was helping handing helping hand boosted but not helping or not uh policy boosted yet and they have my Lodok in the back. Did you really think that was enough to beat Urshifu? My Lord of Bodies, Blaziken! Why did you target Blaziken? I don't understand. I don't get it. They saw a super effective move and they're like, Oh, I have to go for the super effective move, right? You're only allowed to go for super effective moves in VGC. Yeah, okay, buddy. Well, how'd that go for you now? How did that work out for you now? That's crazy. Well, they definitely lose to Urshifu now, so... That's game. But, like, that was a really weird match. <laughs> I've never seen someone just so hardcore ignore what I would say is the bigger threat. The Urshifu is the bigger threat, right? I, I, I'm assuming, right? Like, sure, I had one turn of Dynamax, but first of all, I was faster anyway. And it was my final turn of Dynamax, I'm pretty sure, right? Yes, it was. It flared and protected, yeah. But, like, that was crazy. That was weird. I don't know if I would have done the same thing if I was them, but, hey, it works out for me, so... Anyways, I will be back we're to the next battle. Okay, their team is kind of standard, barring the Zapdos and the Indeedee male. Okay. Uh, that, those, those two are unfortunately really bad for Blaziken. Oh my god. Okay, buddy, I see you. Jesus. Um, it's not great for me, I'm not gonna lie to you, but... Uh... What does Spectriair do? Spectriair... Would probably deal with Bla it, it definitely outspeeds Blaziken though. I have to get to, like plus two, I think, to outspeed them. Maybe. Maybe plus three even. Hold on. No, it should be plus two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It be, yeah, it should be plus two easily. Um, okay. <sighs> what do I want to do here for my lead? I'm gonna go, I think, with a Blaziken Alchemy. Um, as much as I would think indeed it would be a good option here, I think this is just I, I wanna use decorate. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, it's my only reason for doing it. 
Uh, I'm gonna bring Urshifu for sure because they do the Spectre Air and also the Indeedee Mail. And I kind of think I need Swampert for the Zapdos. Honestly. Also for like the, the Insane. Uh, yeah, overall, it should be pretty good. I think so. Let's see. Oh, I'm gonna struggle with this matchup. They have Indeedee Mail and Galarian Zapdos. Okay. Uh, it's, it could be worse. Uh, Tapu Fini is probably like the worst matchup I can have with, uh, with Blaziken. But this is still not great, I'm not, I'm not gonna lie to you. It is not great whatsoever. So I should outspeed Zap as a plus one. They blow oh my lord. <laughs> that's funny. That's funny how they let off with the two things they wanted to not fight today. Oh, that's funny. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. So, um... Issue! Hold on a minute. Uh... Decorate. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. I'm about to risk it all right now. Protect and detect. It does not say max guard. Can decorate go through max guard? Guess what? We're gonna find out right now. <laughs> We're gonna find out right now in ranked. I don't care, bro. If it doesn't have, if it doesn't work, then so be it. Uh, my only goal is to not get airstream this turn, so I outspeed both next turn. So I'm just gonna try it, and if it doesn't work out, then so be it. I can just go for like, I don't know. Uh, helping hand next turn or whatever. But next turn I should have to be Zapdos and be able to deal damage to them, hopefully. I should be able to Oko them, I think. Let's see. Let's see. So there, I, I feel like there's no way they don't target Blaziken, but they might expect to protect as well. But as long as they don't airstream Alchemy, I'm okay. Oh, but now that I said that, they're so gonna airstream Alchemy, bro. They're so gonna airstream Alchemy, bro? Oh, shoot. Wait, no! Don't kill my Alchemy- Wait. I did not think this through! They're gonna- Wait, airstream Blaziken, please. Thank you! Let's go, dude! Okay. So, I have a full HP, life orb, potentially plus two? Potentially plus two? Yeah, it still works. Let's go. Okay, cool. So that was definitely the play because now I'm faster because of speed boost. Uh, unfortunately, I have a really weird feeling that that expanding force is going to KO my Blaziken. <laughs> uh, let's compare Spadef stats and just double the damage, okay? Uh, let's, let's compare it now. So I have 91 Spadef. And 142, so it might not Oko. It might not Oko, so I still might get the KO that I want to uh, to get. I'm gonna go for the Flare and the Zapdos. I don't care if they max guard. If they do, so be it. Uh, I'm going to Helping Hand as well. No, it's a KO no matter what. I'm plus two. I'll go for the Gleam. I'll go for Gleam. And they ally switched. Aren't you fun? Oh, aren't you enjoyable? What a great move. Oh, wow. I'm so happy you went for it. I sure am so excited that you went for that move, bro. Wowee. If only I could be as cool as you using a really fun move. Ooh, wow. I love Ally Switch. Ooh, wow. Would you look at that, gamers? They went for Ally Switch. Get a look. Why did you throw? Did you think Alchemy got Ally Switch? Why is that what you went for? Do they have they have Tailwind, right? They have Indi they have they have Whimsicott, right? Yeah, they do. Okay, okay, that's, that, that's fair. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> that's fair. I'm gonna go Swamp right now. You're gonna regret your entire like life choices, but you know, um, they're gonna go into Whimsicott. They're gonna Tailwind. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right. Um, do I have to max guard again? And would that even matter? No way. They're plus one in Tailwind. No, 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 no. Okay, it does not matter. So, I don't think they would Oko Blaziken. And even if they do, then, like, oh well. Um, and I'm gonna go for the Ice Punch into the Zapdos as well. Up to you what you go for, bro. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 buddy. You already had the favorable matchup, and now you're trying to flex on me. I understand, bro, but you're not gonna Oko... Mm, mm, the update, it Okoed my Blaziken. Mm. Hmm, would you look at that? Okay, uh, could have been better. <laughs> that could have gone better. Um, I can't freeze because of the sun, so that's tough. Uh, 
Well, 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 well. Okay, so that was a crate. That's pretty nice. Okay, uh, this was a not good matchup to begin with, right? That was like it was a pretty bad matchup overall. Uh, with uh, with uh, with Bl for Blaziken, right? Because they had an Indeedee male Zapdos lead, but then they clicked the degenerate move of Ally Switch. Just had to. God, this entire game came down to the allies, which too. That, that's crazy. If they didn't go for it, they, they lost 100%. That sucks, dude. That sucks, dude. That sucks, dude. Uh, they probably have Spectriere in the back, I would assume. Or maybe Rillaboom, because they have Swamp Bird, so. Um, Urshifu is very important, but unfortunately, Sucker Punch wouldn't KO Zapdos. And they outcome me no matter what with both of their Mons, so. I believe it is over, gamers. I believe it is over. Unfortunate, 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 unfortunate. I, I, I don't see a way I can play my way out of this right now. So, that doesn't Oko, yeah. Well, of course it wouldn't Oko, it's resisted. And they're gonna Brave Bird, they're gonna kill my Mons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not gonna KO this. Oh. Well, that's interesting. I forgot about recoil damage. <laughs> I forgot about that feature of the game. I didn't have to go for what I went for. Oh, okay. Uh, never mind. I did. Okay. Yeah, it didn't matter. Um, ice punch. I don't think I'll go for this range. Not a chance. Actually, they're probably stashed anyway. So. Oh my God! <laughs> I did nothing. The reject button. No, they're leftovers. I just lost to a leftovers whimsicott. There's a reason they don't run that, it's because it never lives a hit anyway, bro, except for that. That one's bulky, obviously, they have Rillaboom, yeah. So, I think it was a lost cause no matter what, because Rillaboom definitely beats Urshifu 1v1, so. Oh, that sucks, dude. Oh, why is that a matchup I had to get? Why did I have to get Galarian, Zapdos, and then Ally Switch and Didi? Like, why is that what I had to get just now? That sucks, dude. <laughs> that blows, okay. If I led, like, Indeedy Swamper, I won the entire battle. <laughs> 100%, or, or, or if I just let him DD in general, versus the Zapdos, I could've won. I could've just been like, max flaring and follow me all, the, all day, bro. Oh, I'm so stupid. Oh, well. Well, anyways, uh, I will be back and get into the third and final battle. Okay, a sun matchup. Sun room specifically, but they don't really have a great trick room option. They should drop the lander for like a Glacier, honestly. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Um, I do not have my safety goggles and which would easily sweep their entire team. Actually, they have Landos, never mind, it wouldn't win that easily. Um, uh, but I do see Alchemy Blaziken being very, very good here overall. I don't see much of a way they can deal with it beyond Charizard, so. And that's exactly how they're gonna deal with it. Oh, shoot, bro. <laughs> oh, shoot, bro. Okay, uh, if I was physical Blaziken, I'd have Rock Slide right now. That'd be super lit, but I don't have that. Maybe I just leave, like, Swamper and Didi. Yeah, just just lead Swamper and Didi. Just do that. I can just do that right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, as much as I want to do Blaziken right now, I'm just gonna lead Swamper and Didi, bro. I'm gonna bring Blaziken in the back for sure because I have to. Um, and my last mon of choice is going to be. I really don't want to lose to Pain Split Dust Clops. I guess Zarina could do that as well, but Zarina sucks here, so never mind. <laughs> I'm gonna bring Urshifu. Uh, poor Zarina. I'm not gonna match today. Not at all. Zarina's great if they're like Feeny or whatever, but I haven't seen a Feeny today, so which is actually good for me, but honestly, I think I'd rather deal with Feeny than deal with uh, the NDD Zapdos team. Alright, what do you lead off with, son, bro? What do you lead off with, son, bro? You should also have P2 instead of Dusk because it sucks, bro. Venusaur Torkoal. Oh, wow! You led Venical. You are original. I have never seen that before in my life. Wowee! Whoa! Why am I not Goggles and DD? <laughs> Uh, I didn't bring Alchemy, so I can't avoid getting slept right now. Uh, kind of unfortunate, I'm not gonna lie to you. But, I can just Hailstorm and change their weather and ruin their entire day. So, I'ma do just that. I'ma do just that. They're probably gonna sleep in Deity, which means they would die to Hailstorm, so. And if they do that, then that works out great for me, honestly. Uh, I'm going to... I, I wanna help again pretty badly, but I don't want Swampert to just die. It's, it's too risky. So, I'm going to follow me, buddy. Let's do it. Let's do it, son, bro. They Dynamax the Venusaur turn one. Oh, okay. Yo, Venicol's annoying. <laughs> Venicol's annoying because they either Sleep Powder or Dynamax turn one, and you can never predict which. But, 
No, indeed does not live this turn. But I do change their weather, which is really good. That's actually all that matters. The uh, the weather change will keep me like going, I'm pretty sure, because I can go into Urshifu afterward and just like hit them like really hard. They would probably swap out. Hmm. So next turn they're probably gonna max guard and swap out. And the Torkoal and like something else, and then they can swap back in for the speed, right? If I had to guess. Um, they probably definitely kill Ndidi though, with Vine Lash plus, uh, whatchamacallit, Eruption. Actually, that's not that much damage. Hey, yo. Oh, wait, wait, at the sun? Never mind. You don't kill me. You can't get. Wait, but the Vine Lash is a broken, overpowered move. I forgot about that part. God dang it, bro. I forgot it was stupid cheesy, bro. <laughs> I forgot that move was, was literally autopilot. I forgot about that. Shoot. Okay. <laughs> the Vine Lash is gonna KO me now. Heck. Wait, it's not gonna KO me! Let's go, Indeedy! Yo! Ayo! Okay. Um, I can't really imagine a world where they don't swap out Torkoal here, so I'm gonna Quake it. They're gonna max guard and swap out Torkoal, so I'm just gonna go for the- Actually, I'm gonna go for the... Hmm. I could go for the Geyser in that slot. Wait, does Indeedy die a hail or did it already take the hail damage? Oh, please tell me it already took the hail damage. Okay, we're good. Leftovers, we are finding the most interesting leftovers users today, buddy. Okay, that's interesting. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure they would max guard swap into probably Charizard. Um, or maybe Dusclops or Whimsicott. I think my safest option would be to Geyser into that slot. And to go for the follow me. They, they, they definitely max guard swap out, right? I guess they're faster anyway, so would they even bother? No, they wouldn't even bother, would they? Oh, I'm stressing. I'm gonna, just gonna I'm gonna predict it right now. I'm just, I'm just gonna predict it right now. I, I think it's the better option. Uh, just to be safe, follow me. Just to be safe, just to avoid, you know, me being wrong. Okay, they did max guard, but they did not swap out. So I was half right, but I don't know why they did that. Because now Indeedee dies and then go into a faster Mon. And we almost Oko Torkoal as well. Okay. Uh, that's lit. That's phenomenal, actually. Because uh, now they won't do very much damage with the Eruption at all. Alright. And they, they go for it anyway. Okay, so they're like, what? They, uh, did they even do damage? <laughs> that was a crate! <laughs> I know it wasn't, buddy. That's tragic. Okay. Uh, are they Black Sludge Venusaur? Is that what that was? What a weird team. What a weird sun team. Um, but from here, I don't see much of a downside to just going into uh, Urshifu. Because the Venusaur is like slower for sure. Oh, I could go into Blaziken! But I'm slower than them. Never mind, I can't go into Blaziken as much as I want to. Oh, I really want to though. I can like protect. But the Swampert would die. There's, there, no, no, no. I'm not going to play stupid just for the thumbnail Pokemon. I don't, I don't care. I, I don't care. I'm not gonna throw just for that, bro. I'm not gonna throw just for that. As much as I want to, I can't do it. I cannot do it. So I'm gonna go for the geyser as well. Tor Torkoal, and I'm gonna go for the Wicked Blow into the Venusaur. Blaziken will have its time, hopefully, in this battle, but we'll see. We'll see, because right now, it's not looking great. They, they switch out? They protected Torkoal. That's not gonna matter, though. Both of my mons will kill you through protect. Why did you bother? So... I really don't know why they did not switch out. Like, in my opinion, swapping out, like, at any given point there was the play. But, didn't happen. Alright, now it's a 3v2. Oh, how the turntable, sun user. What's your plan now? This is why Venusaurs go for sleep powder, because they lose. Otherwise, <laughs> Swampert being Venusaur, bro. Swampert, like, you know, being the ultimate Venusaur counter. Let's go. Uh, okay. The prediction of the max guard was so lit, though. That worked out so much better than I thought it would. 100%. Although, I think I would have been okay no matter what. Because if I went to Urshifu and just, like, Wicked Bloat anyway, I think I would have been okay. Then I could just Geyser again that turn. So, I don't think it had to be... I, I don't think I had to predict the move there. But maybe I did, because I still had to turn on max. Yeah, maybe it did matter. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, uh, Lando and what mod? 
Char, you brought Charizard? Even you brought Charizard, but you max Venusaur turn one. You typically only bring one of those if you're gonna Dynamax, or you just spam sleep with the Venusaur. Alright, I'm not too sure about that one, buddy, but you know what? I more power to you. More power to you. Um this battle is far from over right now, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um I yikes. <laughs> These two are really bad for Blaziken right now. Uh, I'm gonna Geyser, Charizard, and Wicked Blow, Lando. I outspeed Lando, so if I live anyway, I just say Geyser Liquidation. Um, they hit Swampert. That works out for me. That works for me, buddy. I don't care. I do not care whatsoever. Eat this Wicked Blow to the face. That works for me, I'll take that. You should have killed Urshifu, that was your target. Your target was absolutely not Swampert. Actually, kind of was. On, I mean, honestly, they, yeah. Both were threats, but still. Um, Yeah, never mind. I don't think they had much of a chance there at all. Like, both my mods O-Code. Yeah, they didn't have much of a chance there, honestly. Maybe if they, like, air slashed Urshifu, killed that. But then they would have had to be able to kill Blaziken and Swampert with just Lando. Nah, no way. Not a chance. Anyway, anyway, um, I am going to call the video there. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Comment, subscribe, like, all of that stuff, and I'll see you all in the next video. Later.